Hello, today I'm going to show you how to power your WordPress site with your real estate listings directly from your MLS, all in under about five minutes. We'll be using a plugin called Simply Rets, and you can find a link to that website in the description of this video. Also, we're currently looking at the home page here, which is where you can go to create your account and we'll need your username and password. For the sake of this tutorial, we won't need those things and we'll be using test listings. However, to get your listings on the site, we will need to get those at some point. In 2015, online sales are more than a big deal. The majority of new clients will start their home buying process online if they don't already know a realtor. This plugin allows you to get your listings directly on the pages of your site with no iframes. This gives your visitors a more personalized and professional way to look for houses without ever leaving your site. This is essential in converting online visitors to buyers. So let's get started. The first thing we need to do here is install the plugin. The Simply Reds plugin is available in the WordPress directory. So all we need to do is from our WordPress admin panel, go to the plugins menu and go to add new. On this page, we can search for Simply Reds and the result will be here. Now, we click install now and we confirm the installation. WordPress will do its thing and we'll see some messages on the screen, downloading, unpacking, installing, and successfully installed. So great, we've made it to this point. Let's activate the plugin. And again, we'll let WordPress do its thing. On this page, we'll see a success message that says plugin activated. So great, we're about halfway there already. Next, we need to activate our Simply Rets account with the Simply Rets plugin that we just installed. Now, there are test accounts and test listings provided, and that's what we'll be using. And that's what you can use to install it and make sure that you can put it on the pages that you want and it has the flexibility that you need. To get this activated, we'll go into the WordPress settings menu and we have a new option called Simply Rets. On the Simply Rets admin settings page, we have only two boxes, API username and API key. This is the spot where you'll put in your username and password for your Simply Rets account. We'll be using the available test credentials, which are just simply rets, simply rets. This will allow us to install the plugin and again, play with the listings and play with all the features just to make sure that it does what we need it to do. So we've plugged in our username and key and we'll hit save changes. Once again, WordPress gives us a success message that says setting save. So great. We have the plugin activated and have entered our credentials. Now all that's left to do is to start putting listings on any page that we want to show them on. To start simple, we'll create a new Simply Rets page. So if you notice, in our WordPress admin sidebar, we have a new option called Simply Rets with a couple of sub options to view all of our Simply Rets pages or add a new one. This is pretty standard WordPress stuff, so if you're used to WordPress, it's the same as the built-in posts and pages. Now, we have a page here called Luxury Properties. For the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to add a new one, and we'll be starting fresh. On this page, uh, again, it's very similar to uh, all of the other WordPress posts and pages that are built in. We have a spot for a title, which I'm going to call it My luxury listings. We have a spot for a body where we can add any text and images and all of the other awesome things that WordPress allows. I'm going to put take a look in my luxury listings. Now since this is a Simply Rets page it gives us a few additional options. Um, the main one being filter results on this page. Now I called this page my luxury listings and that means that I want to filter down the results that are shown on this page. I don't just want to show all of my results. I want to, I want to attack a specific type of visitor. I want to attack a luxury home buyer. So what I can do is in the filter results on this page, we're provided with a drop down. We can filter by minimum and maximum price, minimum and maximum beds and baths, listing agent, listing type, and all of those great things. Now for luxury properties, I'm going to set a minimum price on this page of 500 
thousand dollars. What this will do is whenever a visitor goes to this page, the listings that are shown here will all be above that price range. Now we can set multiple filters and we can use them in any sort of combination that we want. We're going to keep it simple here and just use the minimum price filter. So now we have our title, our body, our filter, and everything that we need. From this point, we will publish the page just like a regular WordPress post. And WordPress will give us another success message that says post published. Now, I'm working with a uh, very simple, fresh WordPress install. There's no installed themes. We have the default 2015. Uh, there's no pages made or anything like that. It's a, it's a bare bones WordPress install. However, if you already have a WordPress site, it will work with your current theme and you can add new pages and do all of these same steps without any additional setup. We're just using a standard one for simplicity here. So as we can see on our homepage, there's not much here. Back on our Simply Rets page that we just published, uh, we once again have the success message. Now there's an option here to view the Simply Rets page. So I'm going to open this up and we will take a look at the page. Now as you can see here, we have our title, we have our body, and then we have all of our listings from our MLS and they're all above $500,000 with the filter that we set. Now we can scroll down this page and take a look. By default, there will be 25 listings shown on this page. The MLS disclaimer that is required is built in. So this page is done. These are your listings and there's no, no more setup required. Now at this point, we can take a look. All of the important information about these listings is shown directly on this page. Bedrooms, bathrooms, square feet, listed date, listing agent, city, subdivision, year, the list goes on. We have all of this information right up front for the visitors to be able to get a very simple overview of these listings quickly. If you take a look, we also have one more link for each of these listings that says more details. Now that's the beauty of this plugin is that built in there is a details page for each and every listing which we'll go to now. As you can see the page is populated uh, with the title being the address and price. We have a big cover photo and we have all of the important information specifically about this listing up top. Now the great part about this is that once again it's built in and there's no additional setup. All of these pages are generated for your listings automatically. If we take a look on this page we can see all of the information up top but if we keep going there's even more. We have listing details, we have geographical data, listing data, address information, listing information, and MLS information. This page will show all of the data that your MLS provider gives you about your listings. And once again, no additional setup here. This is all built in. I didn't do anything before this. I just created the page and we were good to go. A couple other great features about this are the photo gallery that are that is built in. Um, we click on the show more photos button here and it provides us with a photo gallery below it where your visitors can click through and have this very good looking photo gallery. Um, this, this, these pages will, will morph to your theme and will take the colors and layouts from your theme so it looks like it's built in and it's a seamless integration. Your visitors will not know that you're using a plugin. It seems like they're directly a part of the site. Now that's essential because a lot of visitors one, don't like iframes, and two, if they click on a link in an iframe, it takes them away from your site. Uh, now that's not good. You obviously want the visitor to contact you about the listing. And that's what this plugin really provides, and that's what this plugin really tries to do. Um, and so that's it. Now we have our pages with our listings on our WordPress site. There's no additional setup or anything like that. Um, we're going to post a few more videos and in the next ones coming up we'll talk about uh, how to customize this plugin, how to maybe get some custom styles in there, search forms, featured listings widgets, and the abundance of other features that the Simply Rets plugin provides. Uh, so stay tuned and thanks for watching.